The American Investor with your host, Kimberly Cole. So BioHeart started back in 1999, as you said. Was it controversial back then when you started? Yeah, at the time in 1999 when BioHeart began, I think there was a lot of unknowns associated with stem cells. They weren't necessarily as big in the media as they are today. But I think there still remains a lot of confusion around stem cells. Um, the general public doesn't necessarily understand the differences between embryonic and adult stem cells. Um, and in BioHeart's case, we focus solely on adult stem cells. And I think another key aspect is that BioHeart focuses on autologous therapies. And what this means is that we take cells from the same patient and we put them back to that patient uh, as opposed to allogeneic stem cells where we would take stem cells from a donor and put them into a patient. So in the case of using autologous type therapies, which is what BioHeart focuses on, um, there's no concerns with rejection. Um, you're taking cells from your own body and putting them back into your body.